Today, a nonprofit organization, Into Action, invited the public to a cookout open house for the community to celebrate receiving over $1 million from the American Rescue Plan Act. ABC 17's Ebony Andre spoke with staff members about the impact this grant will have and how they will use it. Ebony? Yeah, so earlier today at this spot, there was a lot of people, good vibes, good food. And I spoke with Dan Heideken, who is the executive director of Into Action. And he says that they are so grateful for receiving the $1.2 million from the Boone County Commissioner's Office. They also received $100,000 from Veterans United. And more money might be coming in as they currently have a pending proposal with the City of Columbia. The organization is planning to use a portion of the money on respite care, which is, which is a safe and temporary home for people to go to when they have a relapse of symptoms for those with substance use disorder. The other half of the money is going to be used to pay for a new building to expand its re-entry opportunity center. According to the Prison Policy Innovation, each year at least 128,000 different people are booked into local jails in Missouri. One commissioner told me the main reason Into Action received the award was because they believed the organization was making a change. They get out of prison and then they cycle back through because they're not getting the kind of resources that Into Action provides folks. And so talk about transformational change. Um, the recidivism rate is so, is so low for Into Action, it's, it's a national model. The commissioner's office awarded 26 application, applications uh, uh, over the hundreds that applied. In Columbia, Ethne Andre, ABC 17 News. Thank you, Ebony. The second round of ARPA awards in Boone County is yet to be determined, but Thompson says it will be more difficult because there's only $8 million to work with.